Ahoy! Welcome to yet another vlog where I am attempting to fulfill my fall bucket list. <laughs> we got quite a bit done in the last one. Um, excuse my hair, I did straighten it this morning. Um, and then we went to Walmart to pick up a pumpkin and stuff. And it rained. We got my fall colors going on and it's pouring rain outside but the leaves are changing. The leaves are changing and it's lovely and I love it. I really have to get around to fixing um, this skeleton unicorn uh, because I want to put it up somewhere. <laughs> okay, so let me give you a quick little Walmart haul now that I got my hair out of the way. Uh, I got a new rolling pin. I'm so excited about this. I actually didn't mean to buy this. Um, I needed a new rolling pin because my last one broke, like right out busted. Uh, and I just kind of kept forgetting to buy one every time I was at the dollar store. And then this was on sale at Walmart, and it is a Pillsbury non-stick rolling pin. I don't know how non-stick it actually is, but it's made out of metal instead of wood. And then I did, of course, get the uh, Halloween sugar cookies. So we've got the goose, the spooky ghosts, and the pumpkins, same as every year. Oh, I did get a big-ass pumpkin. And then I got the silk pumpkin spice creamer um wanted to try this out also the more pumpkin spice creamer i can get before it goes out of season the better and then lastly <laughs> this one is probably gonna make me sick but just not worry about it because it's a one-time deal i will make myself sick once for these cookies these are pumpkin spice cookie doughs with cream cheese flavored chunks. Okay, cream cheese flavored. So I'm hoping that means that it won't make me sick. Okay, I'm making like the easiest fucking dinner in the world right now, but it seems fancy once it's made. Um, I've got PC gourmet barbecue sauce, the gourmet version, and a Pyrex pan. And I'm just gonna drizzle a ton of this on the bottom. Uh, Kamsa. And then I got a big ass glass plate and a packet of crispy shake and bake. I'm literally just gonna dump this on the plate. Pork loin. Shake and bake. Put that right on top of the barbecue sauce. In the oven at 375 for 20 minutes. Okay, that still needs a fair amount of time. So I've got these uh, pre-cooked uh, grilled eggplant medallions. They're supposed to have a smoky grilled flavor. Yes. Oh, well, damn it. Okay. Well, these are like super freezer burnt, which is really disappointing because I just bought them. Okay, so beans and you want beans and carrots? Yeah. Beans and carrots it is. That was super disappointing. Oh yeah. So this needs about another half hour, which should be about how long it'll take these veggies to cook. And there she is. Really not fancy, but it only took me a few minutes. I've been up since three. It's another one of those days. Oh my god. <laughs> they are ready. I'm gonna put these in my face. So I started doing like a full on Tiffany Beeston and putting out a tray of fruits and vegetables at dinner time. And it's been working so far. I don't really have to worry about whether or not my toddler will eat Daddy his meal. Not yet, sweetie. We got another hour till he's home. He will eat at least one thing off of these trays. So I just kind of been mixing it up every week depending on what I what is available for groceries 10 out of 10 recommend 
Yet again, the baby did not let us sleep last night. Either of us, we actually had to take turns because that's how bad it was. And I just spent the morning putting the crib together because we're gonna be putting the boys in the same room soon, which means the baby is going to be in the crib and not in the playpen. So he needs to get used to it. So the crib is now set up and he is not napping in it. What are you doing, sir? The raspberries? Yeah. Uh, how about we put them in the fridge? <laughs> Same with the radishes. The wilty radishes. These turn out rotten. Actually, speaking of rotten, I need to have a look at these. And it's wrapped. Winston. Winston, still in the wrapper. And you still can't have it. Okay, groceries. What else we got? I love groceries. Okay, I have a huge mess that I need to clean up before I can cook dinner. I can't see my stove. But I wanted to take a brief moment to add on to my little whole help. The you waving? He's so cute. To my um, haul because I bought these <laughs> last minute because there was a huge sale and I got lots and lots of PC points for this. Um, but I got these from Joe Fresh. I got this wrap sweater, which is just so cute. Honestly, I got this mostly because I thought it would be uh, handy for when the weather gets a little chillier out on the sunroom. Yeah, it is so soft. Oh my god. And this was, I think, 20 bucks or something like that. And then uh, for $8, I got this nightgown because I've been desperately in need of sleepwear. You want another song? You want to get on my nightgown? You want to get on my nightgown? I want to go where the people are. I want to see, want to see them dancing. What's the word again? Oh, P. P. The cake. Slip in your fins, you don't get too far. Legs are required for jumping, dancing. Strolling along down the. What's the word again? Street. Up where they stay all day in the sun. Wandering free. Wish I could be part of that world. <coughs> what would I pay to spend a day warm on the sand? Bet you on land you're gross. They'd understand that they don't reprimand their daughters. Bright young women, sick of swimming. Ready to stand and ready to know what the people know. Ask my questions and get some answers. I've never 
done Thanksgiving from a box before, but this is how we're doing it this year. Watching from the States are as in Canadian Thanksgiving is in October. I'm sure some of you know that. But uh, this was a kind of a last thing, minute thing because we weren't going to really do Thanksgiving. I haven't done Thanksgiving at all, I think, since I moved in here pretty much. Uh, so the toddler really wanted Thanksgiving and I only had about three hours to put it together. So we've got um, turkey gravy. We've got butter and herb mashed potatoes. We've got turkey stuffing, which honestly I'd have box stuffing at a homemade Thanksgiving anyway, just because it's superior. And then I've got one of these frozen turkey breast things cooking in here. I've never done one of those before, so I don't know how this is gonna be at all. Um, but we'll have to see, I, I will show you after. Oh wow, you guys are just really good at all. So I need to finish this vlog off now. Give it a thumbs up if you like these videos. Make sure you subscribe, especially if you're looking forward to Vlogmas. Would you just throw socks at me? Yeah. Uh, merci. Thank you. All right, see you later. <laughs>